design. It is no longer sufficient to create a product, a service, an experience, or a lifestyle that's merely functional. Today, it's economically crucial and personally rewarding to create something that is also beautiful, whimsical, or emotionally engaging, Daniel Pink said. But what is design? John Heskett said, design stripped to his essence can be defined as the human nature to shape and make our environment in ways without precedent in nature, to serve our needs and give meaning to our lives. Our proposal. The new, improved Parker will change the way students learn by creating designers. The process of hands-on learning, uploading and sharing of information, and ability to learn a wide variety of skills that will allow for this change in the school's atmosphere. The results of a school emphasizing design will speak for themselves. A whole new Parker will be a shining light for other schools to follow as design will bring student success to new heights. The school's curriculum will focus on not only hands-on learning with an emphasis on activating each student's senses, thus dramatically increasing a student's comprehension, for this is merely the design. But Parker will also focus on the application of what Daniel Pink calls significance. Another feature added to Parker will be the emphasis on an audience greater than one. The sharing of student work will be shown through the uploading of their information to a wide variety of outlets. It is the combination of these elements that will make our students thrive into the 21st century. The plan to prepare students for the 21st century. The process to implement this design will be reinforced through the school's longer day. The additional hours to the day will allow students a wide variety of options and give their career paths some direction. It also gives students the ability to explore into these career options in a safe environment. Students will be learning using the method that balance utility and significance. Utility is important in all construction. By applying this, you are creating a product that is safely and soundly constructed. However, utility is not enough for people anymore, and perhaps it never was. All products need to have significance. Your product must look good, while having the capability to cultivate multiple options. The combination of utility and significance helps students develop when they were younger. It affects their decision, parents' decision-making and has and will affect their own decision-making. It is time for the classroom teachers to follow the direction of the consumer market. Teaching in the classroom will change at Parker. Students will be asked to learn not just the standard hands-on learning. They are not just going to be creating the simple presentations or projects that we have seen for generations. Here, students will be learning through design. Their focus will be on utility as well as significance. It will be reinforced in the classroom to not just build something that works, build something that works and is emotionally appealing. To give the students the full experience of an audience greater than one, students will be exposed to a wide variety of educational media outlets, including blogs, video sharing websites, and databases, while continually enforcing proper research techniques and web literacy skills. It will not stop there. Students will be creating work that is not just fact-based, but also stimulating and soothing. The combination of these elements will push Parker into the limelight. Richard Kosselick said, I think designers are the alchemists of the future. He is right. Designers will continue to play a significant role in our society. A new Parker will play a role in embracing design in our students' learning while preparing them for this future. The creation of a generation of designers who are equipped with the skills of design will be able to thrive in this uncertain future. Just ask our students here.